let's move on to the highlight of the last two weeks. Pretty much uh, the Montreal Bowl. We had Lugens Dort, Chris Boucher, Kem Birch all duking it out in a Raptors Thunder game. Megan, what stuck out to you in that game? I think the simple fact that the three of them put on for Montreal, like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like there, there wasn't one of them that didn't have some sort of impact on that ball game. And I think it was great to see, you know, we always talk about the talent coming out of the GTA and, and Toronto basketball, West coast basketball as well too. Now we're starting to see the emergence of what Montreal can bring to, you know, the basketball landscape. And I think that that was really the biggest thing is you had three people from the Montreal area put on for the entire province of Quebec and the city of Montreal. And I think it was fantastic. And just, you know, seeing what Boucher has been able to do in his time with the Raptors and being, you know, thrust into the spotlight and, and having this sort of pressure on him, the addition of Ken Birch to the Toronto Raptors as well too, has been fantastic for him. And he's been able to continue to improve game to game for them. And then it's of course, you know, what Lou does with the Thunder, I think is fantastic. So I'm just happy to see that they put on for their city on, on the biggest stage and the brightest lights when all eyes in Canada were on that one game. Javon, do we have a legit rivalry right now between Montreal Hoopers and Toronto Hoopers? See, B, what you're not going to do is have these people crucify me. I'm, I'm not picking, I'm not choosing. <laughs>